Hey everybody, thanks for coming back to the channel. Uh, I just had a request uh, for a little walk around video um, for this H2. And uh, so I'll, uh, I'm gonna do a little, probably four or five, six minute video here. Um, this H2, this is a 2008 H2 SUT. Uh, this one has uh, a complete custom paint job. This is our Nardo Gray edition. Um, so this is one of those Battleship Gray colors, but it's the lighter version. Um, as opposed to these two here, which is the darker version. Uh, those two are both sold, by the way. Um, and we'll be transported here in the next few days this one um is the nardo gray it as you can tell it has our black ops package with the fender flare package um and as we normally do uh with these we put uh, we do the grill and the bumpers in the same body color and along with the fender flares and the rocker moldings and all that um as opposed to uh you know sometimes we'll do an all black front with a black grill, black bumpers. Um, for example, this gray one right here. So see how that one has the black grill, the black bumpers uh, there with the black ops package. That one doesn't have the fender flare package, um, but on these uh, Battleship Gray colors, we like to do that. Um, so, this one, uh, 30,000 miles, and it's gorgeous. This is a one of a kind, this is the only time we've done this color. Um, and in all reality, this is a Porsche color there were several options that we had uh, you've seen this color on Lamborghinis Audis uh, Porsches and so we used Porsche's color um, there's underneath there the frame rails everything nice and clean we uh, so we have, as you'll recognize, the fuel blitzes, 22 by 12 with a negative 44 offset. Our 35 inch uh, ridge grapplers from Nitto. Um, and with these fender flares, I'll give you a, a view here. You can kind of see down the side how the wheel, the tires just stick out a little bit. Looks like we got something, yeah, There's something sitting on top of the paint. You can see how the tires just, just, let's see, there we go, just stick out a little bit, which is kind of what you want. You, They wouldn't look right if they didn't stick out, you know, if they were inside there, because you want that wide look, that, that muscular stance. Uh, so, like we usually do, we go back with all the black accessories, wheels, of course, um, handles, latches, running boards, roof rack, crossbars, and then we do the lights. The lights are cool. You know, I haven't really highlighted the marker lights that we use. These LED smoked dark lights. So let me show you something. So when you, I just hit the lock button, and that's what that's what it does. It's kind of a cool. And then when you unlock it, that's what it does. Um, this is on the front and back. And so uh, this one also has a remote start. Of course, all 08s and 09s that we have have an OEM remote start system. I'm gonna sit back here because this has a dual uh, custom exhaust, as you can see by the dual pipes there. And uh, so I'm gonna stand back here and I'm gonna start it so you can hear the rumble. So 
it's not necessarily louder it's just a different uh kind of a throaty uh sound uh sounds a little more mean they all have a little bit of a rumble and this one's just a little more throaty um it's not loud it's not obnoxious it's not loud especially when you're driving on the highway um we're real careful about stuff like that so let's look inside real quick oh, i need to hit unlock This one has these custom uh, brushed aluminum door sill plates here, which are really nice. The leather's outstanding. Uh, this one does not have floor mats at the moment, but it will. My detailer didn't put them back in, but. Leather really nice. Smells really fresh and nice. You can't see that in the video. Let me hop in and but this is just one of those that everything's just super fresh. I mean even the the this this console area, the buttons, the uh um, center console lid which is your armrest as well even the just the, the steering wheel just super fresh the check or not check engine light the uh, tire pressure light is on which we, I need to reset because we've just put these wheels and tires on so let me there we go so 30,591 on the miles. Everything, everything works. Door locks work, of course. Window regulators, side mirrors, all that stuff. We check, we go through the whole vehicle. Um, this one, uh, you can see, I'm going to rev it up here. You can, you can see there, so it doesn't have that loud, obnoxious, um, uh, exhaust noise that some of those exhaust systems have. Um, cracks in the dash of course everything nice and clean all right so let me pop that in That's good. You can see when we do our custom paint jobs, we go, you know, all the way, all the way in. We don't, there's no corners cut. Um, on the door thresholds. So, under the hood. We don't take any shortcuts when it comes to that kind of stuff. So, anyway, that's it. So, 08. 30,591 miles. Uh, absolutely a one of a kind. This is the only one that exists in the country uh, like this.
and uh, I will be doing a few more videos in the coming days. Uh, we just got this one in. That's an 06 uh, with like 56,000 miles on it. It is the same color, but it's, this one is a, that Kevlar liner paint job. See that textured paint job? Uh, so that has a, a really cool look. Um, and then I'll be doing a few others. So I didn't get to do these because we sold them before I could get the, but we, you've seen these before on our website, the Destroyer Gray. And then I've got a few others coming. We've got that white SUT over there that we're just about to be finished with that has, uh, uh, that's got a custom interior that we're starting to do, a two-tone interior, so that's cool. Uh, so that's it. On a cloudy day in Dallas, Texas, uh, on election day actually here uh, on November 8th everybody get out and vote today all right you guys take care